Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. An emergency meeting was called for the UNL student government. It all centers around Regent Jim Pillen's proposal surrounding critical race theory. The discussion is our top story tonight. Channel 8's Macy Meyer has the details. The removal of critical race theory from the University of Nebraska-Lincoln would have a detriment, detrimental effect on the learning of both future educators and the future students of Nebraska. In less than 10 days, the University of Nebraska Board of Regents plans to vote on a proposal. Regent Jim Pillen has put the proposal forward, wanting to eliminate critical race theory from being taught at the university. An emergency meeting among the student government was called to present a bill opposing that proposal. I think um, this is going to be a great opportunity to... Um, to inspire conversation, but also inspire advocacy. Um, I think people will be educated tonight. I think people will listen to each other. Any student was welcome to join in on the open dialogue as the Association of Students discussed the bill, including those who agree that regents shouldn't choose what is taught in classrooms, but still express their concern with CRT being taught at UNL. I find that teaching something that is divisive and singles people out because of race is wrong, so I don't think that the content of CRT is valuable to the university. Ultimately, the ASUN passed their bill, expressing their distaste with Pillen's proposal. Although the bill would not have a direct impact, the hope is to make sure the regents hear the opinions of the student body. I think that oftentimes, especially in the Board of Regents, um, as a governing body, to not to not value student voices and to not bring in student input is problematic. Um, and I think that this resolution has allowed an opportunity for change. Reporting in Lincoln for Nebraska's trusted news source, I'm Macy Meyer. 